public health gateway is a science gateway that is aimed at you know, reducing the incidence of motorcycle accidents in Kenya. From our research, we realized that uh, these incidents uh, have been growing at a very alarming rate, and uh, it's for that reason that we decided to create a solution. And the solution, we, we named it Public Health Gateway, mainly because it's meant to preserve lives. And uh, the functionality behind the gateway is that it, it alerts motorcyclists on their way, on the roads, so that, so, so that they can avoid, you know, very road, prone, road accident prone areas and from that we are able to save lives. So basically that's, it's, it's a science gateway that we can use to reduce the number of accidents that are occurring on our roads. So the idea is first of all to uh, uh, spread the application via the Play Store and also other stores that everyone else with a mobile device can be able to download it and interact with the application. And on the website of it, we want to um, make everybody access the websites, that is the doctors, uh, police officers, so that they can enter data about uh, various uh, uh, locations where accidents have occurred. And um, at the end of the day, we have also uh, open sourced the project so that anyone else can contribute to the project to make it much better. The main targets are the motorbike riders themselves, um, especially because they're the ones who need to be alerted, especially when they are venturing into areas of likely or potential danger for accidents. The, the other potential stakeholders are, of course, the clinicians who often have indications of um, the effects of uh, these, uh, these accidents. Uh, for example, there's some useful information they could publish that would be useful to, for the <coughs> policy makers, even for the riders themselves. Um, so th those are the main stakeholders. The, the main help has been the, the, the resources available on top of which the applications have been built. It's also been helpful in bringing forth the concept that solutions uh, can be created and uh, providing openly for other people to consume. I think that's quite powerful, um, both in terms of software resources and both in terms of also um, uh, articles that disseminate knowledge that other people haven't got. So SAGAI has promoted that idea that um, we can actually disseminate knowledge and resources uh, for other people, to, for the public, uh, who is, whoever is interested to, to, to use.